Ayapong is voted one of the 26 suitable and attractive destinations solo travel by BuzzFeed. In addition to tourism, the city is also known for interesting tourist sites, like Upper House with modern architecture and traditional old houses, as well as spiritual tourist destinations such as temple, unique culinary culture, etc. All of these things make the city an attractive tourist site. Ayapong is one of five centrally run cities in the third city of Vietnam, after Ho Chi Minh City in Hanoi. Ayapong is also known as the city of flamboyant flower, the largest port city in the north of Vietnam. From Hanoi, you can go along Highway 5A or travel by Hanoi, Ayapong Railway in a few hours to reach the city center. In addition, tourists can travel Haipong by air and sea. Haipong is all famous as a sea tourism city. Ketba Island is recognized by UNESCO as a World Biosphere Reserve. In addition, the city also has interesting tourist sites in the metropolitan area. They are historic and cultural and beauty spots which fully characterize local people in modern time. Visit to Haipong are firstly impressed with the unique, diverse architecture of the harmonious blend between Asian and European cultures. The blend creates a unique urban beauty with elegant and powerful features. Haipong City is characterized with rivers. Winding inner city like Tam back to old quarters creates a poetic beauty, which is the source of inspiration for many artists. Haipong has its own rhythm. Old space and old architecture mixing with modern architecture create a nostalgic feature of the port city. The French-styled architecture in the city center is still preserved. The first thing to mention is the city theater a long-standing building located in the city center. In French colonial history, only three cities of Vietnam, that is Hanoi, Haipong and Ho Chi Minh City had opera house. Haipong City Theater is one of the cultural architectural monuments representing one stage of Vietnam architecture with well-arranged unique decorative motifs and reliefs, which have high artistic values. The city theater was built in 1904 by French architects. The construction was designed elaborately like Parisian theater, and replicates Frances theaters in the medieval age, The harmonious combination between modern and ancient features creates a beautiful, impressive, attractive theater. The inside beauty of the city theater is exalted by the architectural style French civilization of the 19th century. Architects took advantage of the curves to create vivid space of the construction. The city theater is political and cultural a place of French people and rich natives. At that time, 
only French troops or famous troop in the country, were invited to this place. Today, big festivals, special cultural and art shows, as well as other important events are organized here. Despite all restoration, the theater remains intact. It is a unique, impressive architectural work of art attracting many visitors to Haipong City. Located at 51st Yonghe Street, Van Huang Ward, Dusan District, Haipong. This old house inspires a strong impression thanks to uniform color mix, which makes it an ancient, solemn style. The house is situated on high, airy position, showing aesthetic sophistication of the owner. The house was moved from Than Ho in 2004 by Mr. Hong Din Fuck. Fuck rebuilt his house to suit the more than a century old house he bought. According to Fuck, this house is not too much large and high. It is Vietnam ancient architectural design. That is Yu Royal style with dragon-like curved lines. The roof is decorated with leaf-shaped lines which look like dragon fin. Ancient houses of this place not only preserve traditional values, but also feature out this land and local people. Such constructions motivate visitors to love Vietnam culture. Located at the heart of the noisy, boisterous city. The house at number 74, Die Hot Dan Lap Street, De Hang Ken Ward. Le Chan District, High Epong City. Seems to be in a different world with ancient, green space. The owner of the house, Mr. Van Nam. Who has great passion for ancient, is very proud of his house. The passion for ancient values motivates him to preserve this old house for decades. Van Nam House is made of ironwood with a traditional structure of three compartments and two wings. Beams are made of ironwood blocks. The house is decorated with Guyan Dynasty style. Inside space inside and the decoration give a cozy feeling of traditional features. According to Nam, Haiplung has more than 200 old houses. Several of them have been kept intact for more than 200 years. 
thanks to the wishes of former generations. The rest are bought by such people like Van Nam, who then place them in their land and keep them as treasures. Cuisine is a unique feature typical for regions and associated with culture and people. Tourists to Haipong are fond of many tasty dishes, including brown noodle with river crab soup. Actually, brown noodle with river crab soup got famous nationally and internationally. Because in September 2012, the Asian Record Association recognized Haipong brown noodle with river crab soup as one of 12 delicious dishes of Vietnam in the list of Asian good food. Therefore this traditional dish has been preserved and its brand has been developed further. People use tongue and eyes to enjoy brown noodle with river crab soup. Several people compare the dish to unique picture of food. Colors are well mixed together. The brown noodle with river crab soup features out aesthetic value and personality of locals. The dish tastes strong and sweet, elegant but tough. Special color mix and unique implication toward the personality of people in this coastal city. Make the dish be recognized internationally. Haipong people are not picky in choosing accommodation on food. They seem to only pay attention to the food and service quality. Therefore, apart from brown noodle with river crab soup, daily dishes from snails also refer to a special culinary feature of this land. Customers choose snails in small baskets and cook will make foods from these ingredients. Haipong is characterized with stir-fried snails. Spicy stir-fried snails still preserve typical taste of snails with the sweet sauce. Buttery taste of coconut and spicy taste of mung grass and peepers. It is simple to make food from snails. However, the elegant and rich features make this food attractive to visitors. Modern streets and building are being developing with the existence of hundred of year classical constructions, making Haipong as an urban area with a reconciliation between ancient and modern style. Let's visit spiritual works in this place. Let's visit Du Pagoda, also known as Lung Du Pagoda. Located in the city center alley with surrounded by residential areas. Du Pagoda is a spiritual address attracting many visitors.
Lindu Pagoda was also known as Lindu Pagoda. According to legend, in 1288, Tran Hung Dao King chose to stay in Anduong to study naval battle strategy to destroy Omar army in Bogdan. Red Head Group in Lindu Pagoda were in charge of food supply for Tran Hung Dao army. The kitchen of this peaceful pagoda was always busy when the Red Head Group was there. That is why this place was called Du Ki Pagoda to commemorate the credit of Tran Hung Dao. At the center of the harem, there is a 5.5 meters height statue of Shakyamuni Buddha. The lotus-shaped pedestal is 2.9 meters high, including 500 lotus petal carved with Tran Dynasty style. The statue of Sakyamuni here is the largest wooden Buddha statue in Vietnam. Behind is the 11 meter height statue of Buddha with 1,111 small gilded statues, seating in body leaves symbolizing boundless Buddhism world. The Pagoda is near Du Pagoda. This artistic architectural construction remains relatively intact. Visiting this place, visitors can admire precious ancient artifacts like statue system. In this place, the legend about Buddha birth is vividly recreated by the vivid miniature of Limpini Garden. Legend is it that Queen Maya held Ashaka tree when giving birth to Buddha. When Buddha was born, nine dragons sprayed perfumed water to bathe him. Saka and Brahma and female angels offered flowers to welcome him. After appearing on Earth, the Buddha walked seven steps. Each step created one lotus blossom. Then, he put his left arm to the sky and put his right arm down to the land and said, Above me is sky, under me is land. I am the only in between. Referring to Buddha Dialogue Buddha, the Pagoda has statues about the Pagoda has statues about how Buddha preached Kutranu and his siblings about Shakyamuni Buddha and so on. According, statues of the Buddha and his disciples gathering, located in garden in form of the mediation place, are made of white stone accordance with original Buddha models. The pagoda or Haralong pagoda is a large-scale ancient pagoda with unique art architecture. This model has been preserved and developed into a cultural and religious center attracting visitors to Hathipong. 